The thing ever stays nice. It always turns bad. Things aren't always nice, but you can change them. How? The way we always do. We fight. How far will you go to save the ones you love? A Plague Tale Requiem picks up a few months after the end of Innocence, right around the first days of summer. Amicia and Hugo are headed south, along with their mother Beatrice and the young alchemist Lucas, reaching places still spared by the devouring plague, the raging wars, and the rabid rats that are running rampant in the north. Is that a fair? Beneath the warm sun of 14th century Provence, the Darunes are almost able to enjoy a normal life. You're great! Yeah! But for a recurrent dream that Hugo has been having, of a mysterious island that calls him. These look like teeth. It's a two-teeth island. How come nobody noticed their disappearance? Maybe nobody cares. Maybe. One day, the macula illness that's been dormant inside Hugo awakens, and the dreaded living nightmare begins again. In the wake, Amicia finds herself with no other choice but to trust her brother's dreams and head further south towards the elusive island before he's consumed by the terrible macula affliction. The bite, yes. They've locked the arena down. They let them die here. It's starting all over again. Her mind is made up. She will find a cure in what dreams and prophecy may hold. Get used to it. With almost no one they can trust. This is your life now. Amicia and Hugo must traverse land and water as restless forces stand against them. Uh, Amicia! <gasps> you all right? After the events of last winter, Amicia is hardened, experienced, and when backed against the wall, can be surprisingly resourceful. Yes. With several new tricks up her sleeve, she is now able to freely choose between striking from the shadows or unleashing hell with a variety of equipment and tools. Hugo wants more than ever to help his big sister and not hinder their progress. We need to leave or we'll do everything. The macula within him is a double-edged sword that has deepened his connection with the rats. The rats. They can feel people's blood. Now I can too. This powerful ability can decimate entire squads of soldiers it takes a severe toll on Hugo every time he uses it. What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> Thankfully, their journey brings not only hardship, but also unexpected friends. These colorful characters help the Darunes carry their terrible burden. It's not my first time. While offering unique skills and resources to bring them closer to their elusive goal. For Amicia and Hugo, the road ahead will test the limits of what they can endure on all levels and just how far they're willing to go. Reaching the island is only the first step to truly understanding the terrible affliction that's stricken their family as the lines between reality, fantasy, and fate dissolve. Keeping it together and finding the cure to save Hugo will be nothing short of a miracle. But Amicia has hope, and hope is the last thing lost. Others are burned in it. If you kill, be ready to be killed. No! No, no! Hello. Oh, hello. And welcome. You're new here? Yes. Well, actually, we're a bit lost. And where are you going? Not to Rome, I would assume. 
No, we're looking for an island. It has two teeth, and there's a bird, and a small lake, and flowers. It's probably an island with two large mountains. We were told you could help us find it. Not from memory. But I have an old map of the Mediterranean Sea somewhere. Do you want to have a look? Yes, thank you. That'll be perfect. Good people! What's going on? We're looking for a boy and a girl. The girl has killed several soldiers. She's armed and dangerous. By order of Count Victor of Arles, we're searching this camp. I know a guilty look when I see one. But whatever you've done, I won't give up a child. Come with me. another way. Where are they? Don't let's push inside. We must not stay in the open. Stop, Amicia. There are people. I hear nothing. How do you know? I... I feel them. I think it's the rats. I can try to feel better. You're sure about this? Yes. Don't worry. Fine. Careful. Yes. 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 I see them. They're here. Soldiers. Hold on. How? The rats. They can feel people's blood. Now I can too. It's like a noise. Like an echo. So where are they? Close. Coming. I can do it again if you want. Got it. Let's go. Careful. They're trapped in here. They can't go back. Where are the workers? This mine isn't abandoned, is it? I don't start with your bloody superstitions. It's the captain you should be afraid of. The girl pissed him off worse than a thousand Englishmen. Oh, 
Let me uh, breathe. We should wait, Amicia. Oh, no, they'll find us. We have to reach that building. Is it a church? Don't know, but we're too exposed. We'll try in there. Maybe safer. They won't give up. Oh, they're butchers. Did you kill a lot in the Red City? More than I should have. will take place here.
do it! Quick! Get out of here! 